The Tunnel Return has a ton of items for you to construct. Weapons, armor, drinks, shoes, but one of the most important things to have with you when you're traveling around the map is food, especially if you come across an opponent. Which foods are the easiest and most effective ones to make and construct and take with you? Let's begin. Higher rarity foods, for example blue foods, don't always heal you as much as some of the green foods. One of the easiest foods for you to construct early game is choco pies. This is due to the fact that you already start the game with one of the ingredients and the only other ingredient you need is pretty easy to find in multiple places in the map. The ingredient that you start off with that you need for this dish is bread and you already have that at the beginning of the match. The other thing you need is chocolate. By combining these two foods, you get a food that heals you 600. This is more than some of the blue foods that you can make. And for an extra bonus, if you combine choco pies with a box, you get choco pie box. And this food can heal you for 733. Another easy to cook food is bacon and garlic sticks. This is due to the fact that one of the ingredients in this dish is very easy to find anywhere on the map, that being meat. Garlic is also not very difficult to find, and you can find it in multiple places on the map. By making this dish, by combining garlic and meat, you can get a meal that will heal you for 650. Turtle shells, what can you do with them? Well, if you come across one, make sure to take one with you, because if you come across an oriental herb, you can make herbal medicine. This will also heal you for 650. But the best green healing item by far is acupuncture needles. And this is actually one of the easiest things to construct in the game, as long as you know the recipe. This food technically heals you more than the majority of the blue rarity foods in the game, healing you up to 800. And it only takes two ingredients, needles and alcohol. You can find these in multiple places on the map, by having this very effective food with you, you can be prepared for almost any fight. Moving on to some blue rarity foods. Fried chicken, fish cutlets and french fries all have one thing in common and they're very easy to make. They all use one ingredient in common, that being heated oil. This is very easy to make because it only takes lighters and oil. Both of these things are very common around the map. You should be picking up lighters anyway because lighters can help you make heated stones. This can also help you make other type of dishes. So by picking up a lighter and picking up the oil, you can make heated oil and combine that with either fish, potato or meat to make one of these three dishes. Each one of these dishes heals you for 700. Baked potato is also a really easy one to make. By combining potato and a heated stone, that is technically just by combining a stone with a lighter, you can make this slightly lackluster 600 healing food, but you do need to remember that this food is very easy to make since stones are really common, lighters are really common, and you can find potatoes in quite a few places. If you found this video interesting, please give this video a like and subscribe if you'd like to watch some more videos like this. Which is your go-to food in Eternal Return? Tell me down in the comments below. Take care guys, bye bye.